Tracy welcoming you to this edition of Mac TV News. So, Tracy, it seems like just yesterday that we were going to our first classes here at Mac. I know, it's been such a blur. I can hardly believe it's almost March break. True. Just five more days and hello, Florida. You're going to Florida? Yeah, I'm going to Florida to visit my friend there. Wow, I'm so jealous. <laughs> so anyways, how are things going with the SAC? Great, actually. They have not one, but two really cool events coming up next Tuesday. First, they'll be giving away a chance to have your own personal assistant. Hold it right there. Did you just say personal assistant? Yes, that's right. You will buy a ticket in the cafe for just 50 cents, and five lucky contestants will have their own personal assistant that last day before the break. Wow, sounds like fun. What do they do? They escort you to class, carry your stuff, and even buy you lunch and snacks. Wow, that does sound like a lot of fun. So, what was the last thing that you were going to say? Oh, it's even more fun, and you're going to love it. But let's save it for the end of the show. Hmm, that's not fair. But okay, fine. I have something to show you. Is that last year's yearbook? Yes. And do you see all these blank spaces? Yes, there are a lot of them. Yeah, there are blank spaces left because these grads won't take the time to leave a simple farewell comment. Wow, that's like walking out of a room without saying goodbye. Exactly, and it's way easy to do. Simply navigate onto MacYearbook.cf and follow the simple instructions on the site. Did you say MacYearbook.cf? No, I said MacYearbook.cf. That's what I said when I said MacYearbook.cf. Well, then you were right when you said MacYearbook.cf. Are we done? Yes, I think so. Let's shuffle down the hall and find out what's happening in sports with Cache. Hey, Mac. I'm Cache, and I'm here with Bradley and Nathan. How's your team doing in the basketball intramural so far? Um, we're actually doing okay. We're, we actually lost one game, won one, and tied another game. So I guess we're doing all right. We're doing all right, but we're we're starting to gel as a team better now, and we're playing we're playing a lot better after every game. So, if you guys make it to the championship, how do you guys feel you'll do when you encounter Team No Dante again? I don't even know if we're gonna see them in the playoffs. They might lose to Badman Things or Monsters. Yeah, I, I think the same thing. They're, they're gonna lose to those two teams. It's a high chance. <laughs> oh well, we're still undefeated, and we're still the best, and we intend to keep it that way. So how do you feel about the team that tied you last week? Even a broken clock is right twice a day, so it was an unfortunate event. They were very lucky and it won't happen again. Okay, well how do you feel about who's going to be in the finals of this intramural? As no other teams are on our level of play or in our caliber, we just decide not to concern ourselves with other teams. We're the best team in the tournament, nobody could beat us. The only way we could lose is if we were to play ourselves. Okay, well good luck to your team in the tournament. Okay, <laughs> back to you. Thanks, Cache. Sounds like they might be overlooking bad mountains. Taking a quick look at the standings, we see two possible Dark Horse candidates in the Panthers and Nevin, along with Kool-Aid Jammers, both with eight points. But the smart money is still on Team No Dante, currently leading the league with 11 points. You can drop by the gym on Tuesday at lunch to take in all of the final round robin games. A friendly reminder to everyone writing the upcoming EQAO test that tutorial seminars are running every Tuesday after school in the staff lounge. With plenty of helpful tips, even one session can make a big difference on your overall score on March 26th. From Mac in Action, if you're looking for a great volunteer opportunity, then look no further than the MIA door. The MADZ, that's Mothers Against Drunk Driving, is hosting its annual St. Patty's Day Parade on March 5th, and they need your help. Simply fill out the application and return it no later than this coming Tuesday. If you just said St. Patty's Day Parade, then spring must be just around the corner. Let's step outside and check in with Jay and Andrew for the weather. Hey, Mac, I'm Andrew. And I'm Jay. And we're here, here for your Mac, Mac TV weather. weather. It's minus 7 right now, but it feels like a good minus 17. But we, we don't, don't care. care. We're Canadians. Oh. Oh. Have a good weekend, Mac. Ben, back to you. Thanks, boys. That looks awfully cold, but, well, nice snow angels, I guess. Yeah, I like making snow angels too, but I generally wear a coat. Um, what are you doing? I'm showing you what SAC is doing in the cafe next Tuesday. Right, pie facing the teachers. Who's showing? I think Miss Prattis, Mr. Brown, Mr. Will, and others. But you have to pay double to take a shot at Mr. Tarasak. I will so do that. Wait, so they're not really pies? They're just whipped cream? Yep. 
So why are you building it now? I'm just trying to, you know, build a buzz. Wait, you're not thinking of hitting me with that, are you? Of course not, but Mr. Will said he would drop by soon. Want one? Sure. Oh, hey, Mr. Will. Hey, guys, I heard you want to see me. Thanks for stopping in. Uh, Welcome no to the show, Mr. Will. Want some pie? Oh, I love pie. Oh, you got it. <laughs> And I'm Tracy. And I love pie. <laughs>